This is a quick guide. Um, it's part of my APM blog post to how to set up your mouse settings for optimal actions per minute in StarCraft II. Um, what we're going to recommend you do is rather than setting up the options, you're going to use the uh, control panel. So if you open up the mouse in the control panel, you're going to go to pointer options and you can change the speed here. Um, for the smoothest mouse, you want to use a 6, but I personally find this is a little bit too slow for me for StarCraft 2, and I go up to an 8. Um, again, 6 is the smoothest, but I think the speed is more important. You know, it is personal and preference, but if your speed is under a 6, I'm certain that it's too slow. So the key to actually making this work, though, is if you go into the control section, you're going to actually have to disable this enable mouse sensitivity. This will use the def if you un if you check this, Blizzard will overwrite your default settings. You want to uncheck this because you just get better mouse performance if you use the settings in Windows rather than using this. It just seems to work a little bit better. Um, so other things I want to touch on really quickly are the keyboard scroll speed, the mouse scroll speed, and the drag scroll speed. Uh, mouse scroll speed is how fast the map moves when you put your camera to the end. And this is at 50%. It's pretty quick, but I mean, this is. You don't want to actually necessarily max this one out because the only time you're really using this is if you only need to go a little bit. Like if you're controlling your units, you know, you're cutting backwards or you're scouting, you know, you don't want to go too far. If doing this is just. That's slow. It took me two or three seconds, you know quickly moving to where you wanted to go and clicking or using a hotkey like backspace or um, you know, double tapping or setting a unit group and then double tapping and backspace and click I mean these are all just so much faster so this scroll and same thing with the keyboard scroll they don't necessarily have to be maxed because you're not going to use them on big maps usually the mouse scroll is just for microing and the drag scroll though is actually pretty good but it needs to be maxed because the default is really slow. And that's if you push the middle mouse button, you can move the camera like this. So this is really convenient because this allows you to keep your mouse near the center of the screen while moving the camera. So you can exhibit fine unit controls, and if you're cutting a unit this way, you know, or this way, you can move the mouse. Meanwhile, since your mouse is not actually leaving the screen, you can change, you know, if I had my nexus bound to something, you could change, you could um, be controlling this unit in the camera. If this is like, let's say this is your scouting probe, you could, you know, quickly change over and make more probes. So, it is something to try out, and but check the whole APM guide for the real tactics to increasing your APM. Just wanted to show you that you use the control panel settings for your mouse speed as a priority rather than using the blizzard settings. So, hope this video was helpful.